What is up y'all? Welcome back to another paranormal adventure. Today we are at an abandoned psychiatric hospital in New York. Right now we are on the hospital side for adults. This place is absolutely huge. There's a whole other section here just for children. Uh, so this side here is pretty much uh, we are in the operating rooms and there's a couple labs around here. There's tons of floors. There's like 13 floors um, in this building. But this place is absolutely massive, so there's no way I can record this entire hospital. It's mostly gutted out, so we're just going to find the best spots to do a paranormal investigation here. So right now with me today is I got Nessa from Nessa Explores on what, YouTube? This is exploring YouTube and Instagram, right? Yeah, and TikTok. <laughs> and TikTok, so. <laughs> We're gonna get this paranormal investigated, investigation started and uh, we'll get started real soon, so. Ready up y'all, let's go. All right guys, so there are two operating rooms here. Right now we are on one side of it here and I got the REM pod in the middle, right under the surgical light where the operating bed would be. That's your temp sensor, right? Yeah. So Nessa's got a temp sensor in there and you've got an EMF meter over here. So yeah, this is where they used to, uh, I guess, sterilize all the equipment and just a wash station over here. Yeah. So we got another operating light over here her temp sensor and another EMF meter over there. We both have our phones on uh, airplane mode, so it will not interfere with any of the equipment. So, uh, all right, you want to, uh, let's start with the spirit box. Is there anybody here who would like to communicate with us? Can we have a name? Hey. Was that like Paul or something? Hey. John. John, did you die here in this operating room? No? Same, same voice, right? Hey. Hey. Is that where you died? Is that yeah? Mm -hmm. What is that? Oh, yeah. How many spirits are here? Three? Same. Same man's voice. If you die here, can you please touch the red light in the other room here? Can you please touch that light for us on the floor? At least let us know you're here. Talking a lot. How many spirits are with us? Were you treated well here at the psychiatric center? Died? How old are you? Do I think deep in a room?
We're very sorry if you die here, but can you please touch one of these devices for us? There's another device over here you can touch that would light up as well. Recorded? Yeah. Cool. We were also hearing some bangs too. So we'll definitely go quiet for a little bit soon. So her night vision camera was not working once we got here and her devices are being like nothing's really been working so the EMF detector went off by itself. We can use mine now. Yeah, that's the thing. Okay. We'll grab mine, it's no problem. I also have a laser grid on me too, guys. What's that? Temp sensor. Is that you trying to communicate with us? Can you touch the device in the other room, in the other operating table, in the same spot, please? Let us know you're here. Can you make a bang or a tap or a knock for us? from here. Looks like you changed your battery. Oh, shit, again. <laughs> we got the temp sensor going off over there. There's something going on in that room. So maybe we should just stay in here. Yeah. I might even bring the REM pod back over on this side. Yeah, maybe mess with the other I don't know. It's like a, it's like this fuzzing coming from above us. I don't know if the camera can pick it up or anything like that, but I don't know if it's like, they got some, they obviously have some power still in this building, but there's some weird noise and I don't know if the other uh, microphone can pick it up, but. All right. Start asking questions. If there is anybody here who passed away, we heard a name, John. If that's you, can you talk to us please? If there's any spirits that are stuck here, can you let us know your name or 
Give us a number to tell us how many spirits are here. right there. I'm going to bring the REM pod into this room here. If there's anybody here, we mean you no harm. We just want to communicate with you. Let us know you're here. That device on the floor will not hurt you. All it does is make noises and changes colors. If you want us to leave, touch that device on the floor, please. And we'll leave. for another minute. Why won't you talk to us? Do you want us to leave? Can you tell us how many, how many patients died here? No. 100? I think so. 
My name is Chris. Could you tell me your name? Could you touch that again? Hmm. I saw it out of the corner of my eye. It went like very light green. If you're a child that was here, we mean you no harm. Those devices on the floor will not hurt you. It just moved again. You can touch these devices, it will not hurt you. There it goes. Can you touch the other device? start ringing. Yeah. We're going to be leaving here real soon. This is your last chance to let us know you're here. Touch one of these devices. Let us know that you're okay. Let us know that you're here. We're not doctors, we're not people that may have mistreated you here, we're just curious and we want to talk to you. We're just visitors. If you like that we are <clears throat> visiting you, can you light up one of the devices? That's the REM pod. No. <clears throat> Thank you. We'd like to come and visit you guys too. Can you put all your energy into that device? Just wave your hand through it and it'll actually light up different colors. And we'll continue staying here visiting you. But if you don't, we have to leave.
sometimes when we leave the room, if we go to like the other side, they might want to be more comfortable with touching it. So oh, yeah. we're going to leave you in here and we're going to go to the other side. So we're going to leave you alone. You can touch the device and you feel more comfortable alone. So we explored this massive hospital. I mean, this is probably one of the bigger buildings like I've ever been into. And we walked, we walked around for like an hour, if not more, and um, just endless rooms. Like this place is absolutely massive. There's not really much in there, but um, yeah, I mean, I could have made like two hours of just walking around this place. All right. We're gonna leave, so. This is your last chance. Touch that device for us, the one with the red light. Or make a noise for us, let us know you're here. You hear that? Can you make another noise for us? All right, well, Thank you for your time in here. And uh, I think we are gonna move on to probably the children's section. There's a few areas in the children's section of this hospital um, that we wanted to check out too. So uh, when we set up over there, um, maybe I'll walk around a little bit too with the night vision on our way there. And uh, when I see you guys there, uh, we'll start up again, so. You got a EMF meter handy here? Yeah. Yeah, we got like classrooms. Got a chalkboard. So we were just in the adult side. This is the children's area for the psychiatric hospital. Massive psychiatric psychiatric hospital. Or they were like right next to each other, right? The auditorium, the pool. So I think these were all classrooms, or oh, I think the pool's coming up. Watch your step over here. Education department.
Was this it? No. The auditorium. All right. So we probably passed the pool. I think so. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we we just passed it, I think. That's all right, we can, let's start up in here. What's that? And we, oh, and we both have our phones on uh, airplane mode. There is power going in this building too. Could you do that again? Could you touch this device in her hand? Please? Did you hear that? Do you not want us in here? Oh, was this a happy place for you? Did you like this auditorium? Yeah. Flashing again. Yeah. It's hard to pick it up with this, but... It's a nice one. All right, guys, we're going to set up in here and we will see you shortly. All right, y'all. So the next area that we are going to investigate is the auditorium. Oh, that freaked me out. My chair just flipped up. I had this down and it just flipped up on its own. Unless it was trying to get me to fall or something, but um, let me show you guys quick where we're at. So this is the auditorium here in the kids section. It's kind of nice. We got our own seating. And uh, we got the whole stage right here. My battery just died. It was half full. Oh, wow. <laughs> but that's why I still record over here. So, yeah. uh, all right, I got to change my battery. And we got another EMF meter right there. And this is the whole auditorium. Um, got the REM pod set up on the floor. Uh, we have full spectrum camera watching us. We're going to sit right here and probably use the spirit box and the other devices. She's got EMF meter and a little cap ball here. I've never used one of these, but what do you just got to touch it? Yeah. All right. So if something touches it. That thing goes crazy. So, all right, uh, I got my spirit box. Um, yeah, we're just gonna sit here. So, oh, and you got your other spirit box with the temp sensor? Yeah, okay. Oh, all right, let me, uh, you know, you know, I'll set up the laser grid after. No, oh, okay, I'll set it up now. Yeah, guys, I'm gonna set up the laser grid, but I don't know. What did I put in my backpack? Oh. <laughs> I don't know how well it's gonna work in here, but I'll try it.
So got the laser grid. And I'm probably just gonna put it up on the stage here. Did you hear that bang? I don't know. How does that look? Oh, we got the temp sensor going off. So if anything moves through this grid here, we'll see it will disturb the grid. Um, I might move it around, but for right now, we'll just leave it right here. And we'll keep an eye on that. Oops. All right. start this you wanted to see if we can get any any spirit to touch any of these devices here or yeah okay um nothing we can get demonetized <laughs> I, <don't know. laughs> I can't play anything <laughs> that's true <laughs> nessa gonna sing for the ghosts their own custom songs. <laughs> yeah, you can go for it. I don't sing, so. No, I'm not singing. <laughs> I'll play it on my phone or something. If I can find it. 1,000 likes, and I'll sing a little bit. <laughs> If there is any children here with us, do you want to sing the ABCs? I'm going to play the song for you, see if you can just let us know that you like it by setting off one of the devices. Or if you're walking on stage, you can tell because we have the laser grid on. Can you walk up on stage? It flashed, it's flashing. Can you keep walking past the end of the stage? Right at the end. Thank you. All right, we're gonna play you a song. It flashed again. Yep. If you like the song, can you light up one of these devices here? If you like the song, could you touch one of those devices on the stage for us with the lights? Or the black circle on the floor, you can make it light up too. Yeah, touch so this light color. here.
temp sensor. Yeah. Did you like that song? You heard that? What? You hear that bang? That was a loud bang from behind us. I'm going to turn on a device in my hand that you can speak to. You can speak to us. Oh, whoa, they're both going off at the same time. This device in my hand, you can talk to us through it, but you got to use all your energy and you got to speak to us clearly. Okay? Can I have your name, please? Now my spirit box is acting up. Oh, no. Does this every now and then? Yeah, to me too. Sometimes it'll mess with the volume. Yeah. All right, you could sp if you could speak clearly into this device in my hand. Let me know your name. I don't have to. Are you a troublemaker? I am. Are you a brat? Yeah. Did you like the song that she played for you? What comes after A? Can you walk across the stage again for us, please? I'm gonna turn off my light for you. If you don't like the light, I'm gonna turn it off for a minute. Can you touch any of those lights over there for me, please? The ones on the stage? Can you make that light light up and change colors for me, please? Here, please make any device light up or beep. 
Thank you. They don't like me. They like you. <laughs> Do you not like me? Want to try this black one? Circle one on the floor? I'm going to put this device back on and I'm going to leave the lights off. Can you talk to us now? Can you tell us your name, please? Are you an adult or are you a child? Do you, do you want us to leave? We'll leave once you start speaking to us. There's a light on stage. We can see you walk through it. You walk on it. Is it for you here? Do you know that you're dead? Can you try touching this device on the floor here, please? Just wave your hand through or use your energy. And it'll light up. That's all you gotta do and it won't hurt you. Could you touch this device that's right in front of me? Walk right past me, please. Touch this device. You could try to make this ball light up like that. If you go next to it, it'll light up just like how I did it. All right, we're gonna be leaving, so this is your last chance. All right. Can you say bye by giving us a bang or a noise?
My screen is all messed up. Look at my screen. You see it? It's like all pixelated. I don't know if it's recording like that. That's crazy. Yeah, so my GoPro is picking up like real pixelated. It's never really done that before. I don't know if it has to do with the cold. Um, but I'm going to restart my GoPro. We'll see if that fixes it. Much better, okay. All right, guys. We are going to set up in the next area, which is the actual the actual pool. Um, it's a really cool area, and uh, we're going to... It's actually right down the hallway, so maybe I'll bring you in there with the night vision. Uh, maybe not, but we're going to set up in there, and we will see you guys very soon. All right, guys, so before we go to the next spot, we totally missed this gymnasium here, so I kind of wanted to show you guys it real quick. It's actually got all the stuff in here. It's got, uh, yeah, like the bike machines, some lifting stuff. Uh, what the heck is this? This is to, uh... Is this for shooting like baseballs or, oh, this is a light. It's yeah. a light. Okay. I thought it was one of those things for uh, batting cages, but it's not like no backboards. What's that? Oh, oh, yeah, I got you, I got you, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'll keep it low. You got some more flat basketballs over there. Yeah, so the uh, there's some banners up there, but I'm not going to show them so we can keep this place a secret. But yeah, this place just trashed. I think, well, people just shattered the backboards, huh? See, that's why we don't, uh, that's why we don't give out locations, so. All right, so, uh, we got some like locker rooms over here. Um, maybe this connects to the pool. We're gonna find out. Oh, this goes back to the pharmacy. Yeah. <laughs> This is uh, one of the classrooms here. Where the pool's right here. Oh. There it is, swimming pool. All right. So we thought this would be a good spot to investigate, just in case. You know, sometimes people drown in places like this. They'll cover that stuff up, you know, so they can keep getting funding. So we're gonna find out. Check this out. People just, they just always just dump everything into the pools. Can't help themselves. I say we investigate in the pool. In the pool? Absolutely. <laughs> we got washing machines in here. Uh, so those are bathrooms. I don't know what this is. First aid. Okay, yeah, men's room. Um, oh, we got swimming trunks right here. <laughs> yeah, so the 
This is the swimming pool. We got this giant, we think was a light. Probably like a light to light up this whole place. Um, mounting system. Uh, yeah, well, we can set up. Just want to get a little shot of the whole pool and. Yeah, we'll probably set up right in here, so. Why not? Alright, guys, so we are set up in the pool. Right now, we have the REM pod sitting in the middle of the pool. We have EMF meter sitting up on this little, uh, what do you call these little lifesavers? Or. On that thing, so when they throw that in there to pull somebody in, uh, I got the laser grid facing facing where people might dive down to the deep end. Don't know how well it's going to be picked up, but it's just going to be there anyways. Um, we got the temp sensor on the spirit box sitting up over there. It's actually starting to flash. Um, that was just flashing a little bit. Um, I caught out of the corner of my eye, but also I have the full spectrum camera sitting right up over there. So I have it as secure as best as I can. Hopefully it's not gonna fall. So it's flashing again. Oh, there it goes. Can you touch that again, please? There it goes. Thank you. And my phone is on airplane mode. See right there. It's on airplane mode. So that will not affect the EMF meter. You guys know I don't mess around. Yeah, it's consistently, consistently flashing. Can you make it go to red? I'm gonna turn off my light for a second. Can you please touch this again, please? Can you make that go to red? Can you put more energy into it? You hear that bang? Go ahead. Did you drown in this pool? If you drowned in this pool, can you please use all the energy you have? You can make that turn red if you use more energy. Now let me know that you're here. Please. That went almost yellow. Go ahead, more energy please. You can use some of my energy. If that's all you have, then thank you. If you can, can you touch this device here? Can you swim past here? Can you make this light up for me, please? What's up? Okay. That keeps turning off, huh? Yeah, it says full battery. Yeah, it does say full battery. Crazy. 
Was that Crescent? Yep, I see it flashing again. Oh, it's going crazy now. Maybe it has to do with something with the with the lifesaver. I'm gonna move the REM pod to it. Reset that. Reset the temp sensor. Any spirits here that used to swim in this pool? I heard that. Can you touch the device and that lifesaver? Did that lifesaver, did they try to save you with that but couldn't? I'm sorry that they didn't save you with it. Is that why you're stuck here in this pool? Can you touch the other device for us, please? The black circle one won't hurt you. None of these devices will hurt you. They just light up and beep. I'll touch it first so you know it doesn't hurt you. I don't even have to touch it, see? Just wave your hand over it. And each corner has colors. Can you make another noise for us, please? Let's try the spirit box. Oops. Oh, that freaked me out at first, didn't it? <laughs> Can I have a name of who passed away here in this pool? Did I hear like Tom, Tommy, faint, really faint? Like a, like a boy's name? Was somebody left to die here in this pool? You can speak to us, let us know what happened.
Are you okay? Died in cold blood or cold blood or something like that? Were you a boy or a girl? I heard another bang. Did someone from the psychiatric hospital kill you? Drown you on purpose? You can tell us. You won't be in trouble. Dead? Were you happy here? Yes or no? How old were you? Twelve? Seven? That sounds like a man though. Maybe that twelve at first. Can you tell me the name of who hurt you? Or did you just draw on your own? Did it sound like a man said don't? Mm -hmm. Like maybe telling the kid don't say anything or? Where did you die? In the something. Can you tell me what am I standing in? It's going quiet. Okay. Are we in a pool? Sorry. I'm gonna turn out the light. That makes you more comfortable. You wanna turn that one out too? Thank you. Is that you making those noises? Can you make a louder noise? Make a big bang. Are you an adult from the male, from the adult side of the psychiatric hospital? Did you bother these kids?
Make a bigger bang. We're going to be leaving really soon. This is your last chance. Let us know you're here. If you died in this pool, jump in. Jump in the deep end so we can see you. Make a big splash. EMF meter, it's going almost yellow. Make a big splash. Yeah. What do you think? <laughs> Any last questions for them? All right. All right, we are leaving. Just remember you can't follow us. You're gonna stay here, okay? And you cannot attach to any of our equipment. All right, I think we're gonna wrap this up. Get out of here. All right, guys. Let us know. Communicating with us. Yes, thank you very much. All right, guys, we're gonna wrap this up. Um, this place was massive. We've been here for a long time. And um, please let us know if we missed anything, uh, any EVPs that the camera might have picked up, any shadows from the full spectrum camera. Just whatever you guys throw down in the comments. You guys do great. And uh, EMF meter's still going off a little bit. Maybe it doesn't want us to go. But, um, Please uh, check out Ness's uh, YouTube page and her Instagram. I will put a link in the description. So uh, show her some love. And uh, until the next adventure, guys, I am out of here later.